Okay, so good afternoon, everybody. You look good today. Some cameras are off, but it's okay. Okay, keep on smiling wherever you are. Okay, so time for math. Are you ready? Yes, you are. So here we go. Once again, don't forget to fill up and submit your attendance form. Thank you. And once again, my name is Teacher Guapo, your math teacher. So chapter three about length, and we are talking about measuring, okay? We will focus in exercise one about measuring length. But before we'll answer that, let me tell you that this is the textbook that we are using, and this is the workbook that you have there with you. And sometimes I use some uh, references for you to know more about mathematics. So this is the book that we have. Chapter one and chapter two is finished, right? Numbers up to 1,000 and addition and subtraction within 1,000. So we are now in chapter three about length, okay? And we will learn about measuring length, okay? So uh, this time, we will talk about this one and these are the objectives that we have to measure length using meters and centimeters to compare length in meters and centimeters. But this one to compare is will be a next meeting that will be tomorrow. Okay, so let's continue. So as you can see here, how do we measure the distance between each ride? So we will measure by meters or centimeters. Okay, meters or centimeters. So here are the words that we have last time. So everybody, if you know how to read, read it with me. What word is this? This is, what word is this? Anyone? Okay, this is long, okay, long. How about this? Short, okay, good. How about this? Longer, okay, longer, very good, longer. Next, how about this? What word is this? Longest, okay, longest. And this? Shorter. And the last word? Shortest, so this word is long. Then longer, longest, short, shorter, shortest, okay? So next, here, as you can see here, last time we answered this already, that this illustration about the fish, fish A, fish B, and fish C up to fish D, and you will see their, their uh, length, okay? How many centimeters? So fish C is 20 cm, fish D is 15 cm, cm means centimeters, okay? Cm means centimeters, or in Thai, we call it centimeter, okay? Centimeter, centimeters. So in letter A, what is the answer in letter A? What is the longest fish? As you can see here in the illustration, the longest fish here is fish C, okay? And the shortest is B or fish B, and fish A is blank than fish C. So fish A is longer, okay? Longer, very longer. And letter D, shorty. Fish D is shorter than fish C, shorter than San Kwa, okay? And letter E, the last is fish A or fish C or fish D is longer than fish B because fish D is the longest, uh, the shortest, okay? The shortest. Let's resume. Okay. So since it's just a review, here we go. What is the name of this woman? Do you remember? Okay, let us Sok Jang. Sok Jang, what's the name of this girl? Julie. Julie. Is Julie correct? I can see the face of 10, I think is wrong. Almost correct, almost correct. You try it, try again, try again. Ju, Ju, Judy, 
Julie, mm, who can help? Thank you for trying, Subjang. It's okay. Okay. Who can who can tell me? Anyone from the class? Nobody knows. Who can answer? Okay. This woman is. <laughs> you forget. <laughs> okay. Later, later, okay, later. You will know her name later. So she is the shortest woman, as you can see her or here in our picture. I think Sukjang so remembers already. Okay, Sukjang, so can you tell me? And he, this is the shortest man. Okay, Sukjang, so can you remember now? I don't know what teacher you do. Oh, fish. I don't know what page it is. Oh, fish. Uh, we cannot see this woman in our book. Last time I told you no. about the name of this woman. Page, page, you... your book, page 37. 37. We, will, we will answer it later, page 37. Okay. So this girl and name, Juti. Okay. So this girl name, Juti. And she is 28 years old now. Okay, 28 years old, as you can see here, okay? Judy, this is the spelling. So don't forget the name of this woman because I might include this in your exam, okay? In final test. Judy, how old is Judy? 28 years old, okay? How about this man? He is the shortest man in the world, but he is already dead. His name is Chandra. Don't forget, okay? His name is Chandra. And he died at 76 years old, at age of 76. And he is from Nepal, okay? He is from Nepal, or he is a Nepali. And Jyoti is from India, okay? Jyoti is from India. She is 28 years old. And Chandra is 76 years old. And he is from Nepal, okay? From Nepal. And this also, the man named uh, Junri Balawing, he is also the shortest man and died last year, as you can see here, July 28. He is from Sindangan, Philippines. So he died last 2020, okay, 2020. And he is 59 centimeters tall. So just like with almost two rulers. So this is the book that we are using. Now here, before we will answer your book, let me tell you, let me ask you a question. How tall is the cupboard? This is the cupboard. Do you know how, how tall is the cupboard? No, maybe your cupboard there is two meters or maybe three meters or one meter. So which is the, which is, um, which is taller, the cupboard or the lamp? Cupboard or the lamp? This is the lamp. Which is taller? Anyone? It's about comparing. Okay, Ponada. Which is taller, cupboard or the lamp? Cupboard. Cupboard. Okay, as you can see here, cupboard is taller. What is taller in Thai? Can you tell me us? Uh, can you tell us, Ponada, what is taller in in Thai? Okay, taller means what is taller in, in Thai? Sung Kwa. Sung Kwa. Okay, taller means Sung Kwa. Thank you. Thank you, Sung Jang, for the help. Now let us proceed here. As you can see here, we will measure the length in meters. Okay, we will measure the length in meters. So, how long is the sofa here? How long is the sofa? Base, can you tell us how long is the sofa? <laughs> Two. Two. Thank you. Two, one M, and another one M that is equals to 2M. M means meters, okay? So the length of the sofa here is two meters, or let's say 2M, okay? When we say 2M, that means two meters when we are talking about the length. So this is the answer, two meters. Here, she looks like Sokjang. 
So we can measure the length or height of objects such as the length of us and the height of a ladder. And we can use in meters, okay? We can use in meters. Again, we can measure the height or the length of an object such as the length of a bus and the height of the ladder. We cannot say that the height of the bus. Okay, now let's continue here. This matters. So the length of an object is the measurement of how long the object is. When we say, when we say uh, how long, talking about the length, okay? We are talking about the length. So how long the object is? So how long, talking about length, we say, um, how tall, how tall is your cupboard, okay? And so we are talking about height, okay? we're talking about height. But if we say how long, we are talking about length. Okay, what is length in Thai? Do you know what is length in Thai? What is length in Thai? Length. Length in Thai. What is length in Thai? Um. Do you know what is length? Length is quam. Yao. Quam yao. Very good. How about height? Height. Very good. Thank you. So length is kwam yao and then height is kwam sung. Thank you. Basis, he knows the answer. Now let's continue. Don't forget, okay? Don't forget. When we say the length of an object is measured of how long the object is. How long? So we are talking about length because it will, I will include this one in our exam. We say the measurement of how tall the object is called length. That is height, okay? How tall? Tall, height. So the answer here is height, okay? Here, look at the guitar. So the guitar is about one M high. So we are talking about the height of the guitar, okay? One M, look at this is the metal ruler, okay? Metal ruler. So are you more than one M or shorter one M? Base, are you more than one M or shorter one M? More than one M or less than? <laughs> More than or less than? Let us from the class here, other, other students, other students. Uh, let's say mm -hmm, 10. More than one M or less than one M? Your height, your height. More than one M. More than one M. Can you tell me or can you tell us your height? How tall are you? 128. 128. So that is more than one M. So when you were in grade one, thank you, 10. When you were in grade one, I told you already the length of one M is 100. CM, 1M, we say 1M is one meter. One meter is equals to 100 centimeter, 100 centimeters, okay? So 10 is 128, therefore 10 is taller, okay? More than, okay? More than 1M, thank you, very good. I think most of you here, okay, more than 1M. Now here, look at the, the length of the, the blackboard. This is the blackboard, okay? The length of the blackboard is more than more than 2M, right? More than 2M. And the length of the bicycle is less than 2M. Now look at the bicycle. There is a ruler here, metal ruler. Now look at the, the, the blackboard. So 1M plus 1M is equals to 2M. So 2M is up to here only, right? Up to here only. Therefore, the blackboard is more than 2M, right? Because 1M up to here, another 1M, so equals to 2M. So as you can see here, the length of the blackboard is more than 2M because there is more here, right? There is more. And look at the length of the bicycle. The length of the bicycle is 1M and... Oh... 
Look at here. It is less than 2M. The blackboard more than 2M because there's another more here. It's longer. Okay. But the bicycle is less than 2M because 2M is up to here, right? Up to here. So 1M and half. Half of 1M. So half of 1M is equals to 50 cm, right? Because 100, 100 cm, if, if we will get the half of it, is equals to 50 cm. So it's up to here only. While the blackboard 2m is up to here and there is more. So we can see here that the length of the blackboard is more than 2m and the length of the bicycle is less than 2m, less than. Okay, now here. What is the length uh, before that here? One meter is equal to 100 centimeters, right? One meter is equal to 100 centimeters. One meter, or let's say one M, is equal to 100 centimeters or 100 cm. Now here, question. We was when don't forget when we measure the, the object, we will start from zero, not at the end of the ruler. Okay, not say end to end. No, starts from zero. You can see in your ruler if you have ruler with you. I forgot to inform you ahead of time. I'm sorry. So here, as you can see here, let uh, let us see only here if you don't have a ruler there. But if you have, you check your ruler. Okay, check your ruler there. You will see number zero, number zero. So number zero here, we will start from here. So how long is the pen? How long is the pen? Anyone from the class, can you tell me? How long is the pen? How many cm? Look tube, look tube, we will ask look tube. How many cm is the pen? Or how long is the pen? This is the ruler, this is the ruler. So here, 0 cm, 1 cm, 2 cm, 3 cm, 4 cm. How about the ruler, Lokchub? How 14. many cm? 14. 14 cm. 14 cm. Thank you. Lokchub has a microphone. Very good. So as you can see here, okay, the length of the pen is 14 cm or 14 centimeters. Okay, 14 centimeters, as you can see here. Start from zero up to n, so this is the pen, up to here, that is equals to 14 cm. So later, if you have your, your ruler with you, you will miss your, your book, you will miss your, your bag and anything that we have here in your workbook. Now let's proceed first, here, now here. In your book, kindly open your book on page 37, okay? Page 37. In page 37, there are questions from letter A up to letter L. A to letter L, okay? Everybody, pencils up. So you have your pen with you now or your pencils with you. Now let us look at here, the example here. As you can see here, the example, the length of the road, okay, road is measured in meters. Now, I want to inform you that when, the, when we measure long objects, we use meters, okay? We use or we measured in meters. If long, huh? if long, long, yeah, long. If the object is long, we will measure it in meters. And maybe we use meter sticks, okay? Meter stick. But now it's different. They are using, uh, the, the engineers are using different thing. But here, we say only meter stick or centimeter ruler. If the object is short, like pencil, like uh, pencil case, like eraser, we measured in centimeters okay centimeters now let us try to answer this all together so you just write later okay just write late uh, later just answer it with me 
Just tell me your answers. Now, letter A. Letter A. The height of the room is measured by, by what? By a meter stick or by centimeter ruler? What we will use when we measure the room? Height of the room. When we say height, what is height in Thai? Quam. Quam su. Okay, so height. So when we measure the height of the room, we will measure by a meter stick. Okay, meter stick. So we will use meter stick. Letter B. Height of the flagpole is measured in flagpole. We measured in meters. Okay, meters. Because the flagpole is very high. So we use meters. Okay, measured in meters. Letter C. Letter C, the length of the pen is measured in, or I mean measured by So this is the answer. If the object is long, we use, we measured in meters. If short, we measured in centimeters. If long, we measured by meter stick, or if short, we measured by centimeter ruler. Okay, here we go. Now here, there are different sizes of ruler. Some rulers, is 30 cm or 30 centimeter. Okay, some six centimeter. <laughs> 30 cm, 30 centimeters. Or is a, some rulers are 20 centimeters. You can see it here, 20. And some rulers are 15 cm, right? 15, 15 centimeter or 15 centimeters. And the other side is measured in inches, okay? Inches, okay? So here we go. A while ago, I, I told you that I forgot to inform, to inform you ahead of time that you will, you will, uh, you need a ruler. But if you have a ruler, you can measure it later, okay? So just measure it later. I will give this to you as your homework. And you can see this question on page 38, 38, okay? Page 38. So the length of the school bag is blank. How long? So you will use your ruler. So if you have a ruler, look at here. So if your bag is up to here, that means 10 cm. Is If up to here, it's only 8 cm. Okay? So you can use your ruler and then you will measure. Because if we are at school, we will do it uh, like uh, an activity. But for now, this is your, your part. You will measure your school bag. If you have a school bag with you there, so you will measure by using a centimeter ruler only, centimeter ruler. If you have meter stick, it's okay. But I'm very sure that your rule or your school bag is not more than 1M, right? So measure your school bag, the length of your school bag, the length of your book, your math book, your science book, any books that you have there in your house, and the length of your pencil case, okay? The length of your pencil case, you will measure by using a centimeter ruler the length of your pen and your water bottle, if you have it there, and your notebook, okay? So you will measure these objects. There are six objects there, school bag, book, pencil case, pen, water bottle, and notebook. So you will measure it there by yourself. You can ask help from your mom and dad, okay? So you can use the ruler, this one, it's easy to look at if the number is up to here. So that is 14 cm. If up to here, it's 20 cm. If up to here is 26 cm. So just look at the numbers. Okay, just look at the numbers. And you will see there that cm, as you can see here, cm. Cm means centimeters or centimeter. Okay. So school bag, books, pencil case, pen, water bottle, and notebook. Now here, we will do it together. We will do it together. We will measure the height of the following objects here. Now, letter A. What is this? What is this? Anyone? Is this a robot? <laughs> what is this? 
Jaukon. We will ask Jaukon. Jaukon, what is this Jaukon? Is it a teddy bear? Is it a dinosaur? Is it a robot or a doll? I can piece. What what is this? What is this? Is this a robot? Is this a teddy bear? A dinosaur or a doll? This one, what is this? What is this? This one, this. Is this a teddy bear? It's a doll. Okay, it's a doll. Okay. So a doll is in letter B. How about this? Prim, prim. Prim, what is this prim? Is this a, a teddy bear or a dinosaur? Dinosaur. Dinosaurs. Thank you. Thank you. Uh Perry. Perry, what is this Perry? Is this a robot or a teddy bear? Robot. Is this a robot? Look at carefully, please. It's a... It's a teddy bear. Okay, it's a teddy bear. And this one is a robot. Okay, now letter A. Let us answer this now. Let us answer. Letter A. What is the height of, let's start in letter A, teddy bear. What is the height of the teddy bear? Teddy bear. Teddy bear. Uh, what is the height of the teddy bear? Anyone? What is the height of the teddy bear? The height of the teddy bear is? The height of the teddy bear is. Look at the ruler here, in the in the on the left side. Look at your book. Look at your book. What is the height of the teddy bear? So the height of the teddy bear is is twelve cm. Look at here. You can see it here. Twelve cm. Okay. The teddy bear is twelve cm. Now, letter B, letter B, the doll, the doll, what is the height of the doll? The height of the doll is 8 cm, 8. Teddy bear, 12, doll is 8. How about the dinosaur? Dinosaur is 10 cm, and the last one is the robot. The robot is 18 cm. 18 cm okay 18 cm okay finish now let's proceed to page 39 this is the last one page 39 page 39 here it's about the pictures here you will classify okay you will classify you will group them okay you will group them. But before that, this is a matter ruler, which is 100 cm. And the other one is centimeter ruler, which is 30 cm. Okay, 30 cm. So this one is matter ruler, 100 cm. Centimeter ruler, 30 cm or less. Okay. There we go. Let's continue. Meter ruler and centimeter ruler. Now look at the objects here. Look at the objects. So these are the answers for these questions. Okay. So I think you are all finished here. So this is all. Thank you and see you tomorrow. Don't be absent. Tomorrow we will try to compare the length of the object or the height of the object. Okay. Comparing. We will compare who is taller. Sokjang is taller than Alinta or Alinta is taller than Sokjang. Okay. So tomorrow we will find out who is taller, who is bigger, <laughs> who has the longer hair. Okay. So tomorrow we will do it. Okay. Thank you. So try to measure your height. And don't forget to answer the questions on page 38. Measure the following items, the school bag, the book, the pencil case, 
pen, water bottle, and the notebook. Don't forget to answer those, okay? So use your ruler to measure those objects. Thank you and see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thank you. God bless. Drink more water, eat vegetables, and do some exercises. Bye-bye. Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> Goodbye, smart kids. Goodbye, smart kids. See you tomorrow. Thank bye, bye. You. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. You can open your microphone. Bye, bye. And sing bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Okay, bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. So I will just share to you the video later, okay? I will upload first on YouTube and then so that you can watch it. And you can share it to your friends. Bye-bye. See ya. Bye-bye.